Welcome back to the channel. Today I'm going to talk about the um, the Revolver 4X or X4 um, back BAK um, tonneau cover for the TRX with a ram bar. I went with it because of simplicity of operation and it fits. So uh, the only thing about it is since I did go over the ram bar it does step up a little here and it, it does ride a little I got I gotta cut that off it does ride a little high up front but with that lip down there I, and the way when it goes through the wind I don't think that you're gonna ever have water get in there and if it does it'll be minimal but my main thing was security uh, if it does leak in the front, the truck's stock is slightly raked forward anyway, and there's drains in the front of the bed. So it, if it was to seep in there from driving down the road, sitting still, I don't think it would go in. It would just roll off the front. So I do not believe that's an issue. Um, driving down the road would be the only way, but typically the water flies right past it, so I don't see it going in there, but if it did... It would stay right up in the front and drip right out anyway so and if you didn't have the ram bar um then it would fit perfectly fine so i mean as far as sealing all the way to the bottom but uh, so we can show you how it uh, rolls up so all you got to do in the back is grab this here it releases and then the whole thing releases and then you just roll it roll it up so I could roll it a little tighter than that I just did it with one hand and holding the phone so as you see it's pretty easy and it fits I mean right between there so if you had any doubts like is this gonna fit I do like the MX4 um, flip cover the one the it's got like it folds four times or whatever i did like that i had that on my power wagon but the issue with this would be i know it wouldn't flip it would hit the ram bar for sure because the ram bar tapers at the top so it wouldn't clear so i figured this would so also i wasn't sure how it worked you know before i got it so you have these little uh, edges here so it, it just rolls on to the cover onto the rails I should say and then when you push down on it and when you push this down there's a lip as you can see that catches every single one of these so the whole top is completely latched to the rails so security wise I mean I'm not saying nobody could break it open but and you just push it down, let it lock into place. So when you push it down, you have to push it down at the same time. You know, right and left side, that latched right in. So, um, yeah, so now if I push from underneath, it is solid all the way to the front. So, this installs like any other cover. You have your uh, clamps there. I have four of them. And that's about it. So far I like it. Um, it's only been like a week, but I don't see any issues with it. So if you want security in your bed and keep stuff dry, this is the way to go. If you have this truck, I have nothing against the... Uh, the flip back uh the back flip covers it's just that on, with the ram bar i was thinking about taking it off but then i kind of got used to it being on there i didn't want to take it off and it kind of gives you the ram bar kind of gives you a little extra looks like places to tie stuff down to too so and i kept the lights off my power wagon so i'm gonna mount them up there too although it does look like it could possibly be a perch for birds so to shit all over the back of the truck but uh 
Yeah, and this thing, it, I, it is lighter than the MX-4, though. So that's another plus. And I do like the fact that when you roll it up, it does not block the window. So you can still see out of the back window. So that's another plus. So until next time, uh, I will have, actually, I will have some other things to do to it. Just small things, but I have a few other things to do to it that I will be doing videos on too. So more to come on this. All right. Bye.